have a TV at home? How many have two or more TVs at home? Okay. So pretty much we are all getting influenced by TV in general. So I'll be just pretty much talking about the um, controversial theory. It's pretty much saying how TV and media in general influence how we see things in the world, how we see people. Um, today I'll just pretty much be talking first about how the theory came up and how it was getting started from the actually the ancient Greece, how storytelling started being being influenced, and from there I just talk about how it's getting influenced today, like today and how the theory is being used by and on TV. Okay. So it all started in ancient Greece, how storytelling first so it, how storytelling was pretty much face to face, how it influenced people, how Socrates was pretty much saying, you know what, we should do this and this and this. That was the first start of the controversial theory. Then it went to actually the industrial revolution, pretty much how the newspapers, the media, the first time that the newspapers actually came up, and how people were actually reading a lot, of, uh, pretty much reading a lot of the newspaper. And from there they actually got influenced. For example, the World War II, the yellow journalism. Then actually went to when the TV, the 1970s, when TV actually came up. So that was the point when a lot of advertisements actually came up and tried to influence the people to get things. And um, who was kind of the theory that actually the theory is? It was pretty much George Gerner. Uh, pretty much Mr. George or Dr. George was actually born in August 8th in 1919. He was actually in the war, like in World War II. He actually went to Germany and pretty much when he started seeing how media was influenced the war, he saw how, like in the 1970s after the war passed, he actually saw how TV was influencing us. And how TV actually came up and changed the entire media of how we see things. For example, right now, who sees Family Guy here? Yeah, so that's a really big influence, how we see other people, other races, and also in advertising in general. Uh, pretty much um, Planned Parenthood advertisements, you know, two years of condom, wild sex, and everything. And um, <coughs> so, pretty much, uh, we did talk about, um, it is important to talk about him, but it's also important to talk about how we see things in today's world. Um, we actually have, I have some couple of videos of how we actually do see this today in the real world. So, Well, this thing is worthless, like my Palestinian alarm clock. Allahu Akbar! Well, as you can see here, um, Karen Guy is actually implying or saying that, you know, those um, Allah or the Middle Eastern actually being terrorists. And every time we hear that noise, all oh, Middle Eastern. And we have to think of that. And the way we see things now is actually, I, in my way, I, I see it like it's really bad because TVs and media is all it's all around us, and having that influence on us, we see things in different way what people see. Like if, if the media, like you say, if a person here from Middle, from the Middle East sees us, he, they'll be really offended. Like we don't do that. There's some other people that do that. And if we see, if we imply that to other people, we actually labeling people. And that's how media right now is actually really impacting us. And um, I have another video. Let's go. So this was actually the Super Bowl. Whoever watched this, who watched the Super Bowl? Okay, so did anyone watch this one?
point, we all think, oh, it's, we're going to start a war. You, as you can see in the first one, it was India. I think it was India, Middle East, and then Vietnam. And then it goes to, like, I think it's like during the Civil War, of, like between Russia or, anything, or something like that. And from that point, we see, oh, war. But when we actually get to a point, entire mindset from that point of set right there like wait what happened what what wait I thought it was going something's gonna start like a war and this is how I pretty much the great the great impact that we have in media of at first wow it's gonna start something really big and then it turns something you know like for this one it's actually like love peace and pretty much is the axe from the axe from commercial is pretty much if actually we're actually gonna be in peace so in conclusion, I'm just saying uh, saying that it, uh, TV is a great impact in our lives. And uh, in general, just next time, next time you watch a commercial or a TV show, just think about how is that influence us right now and what we see in the future or we see other people. Thank you very much.